Hey there, and welcome to our TMK broadcast. This is your host, The Buckethead, and tonight we are playing against Dials and Dice. They're streaming this too. We're doing a co-stream, so make sure you check them out as well, because they're awesome. Let's see, I think we have some information here. Roll dice uh, on token side of board, ping your attacking ship, then ping your targets. You know how to attack, not stack your damage cards so we can keep track with the stream. All right, cool. I can do that. Wait, roll your dice. Roll dice on token side of board. I think this is token side of board over here. All right. Uh, I need a promote. I need a promote. Let's get the Rebels deck here, huh? They got all fancy. There's promote. Objects saved. Objects. And this is again Commander's League, so there's that. All right. That's not the one I wanted. Nor is that one. Let me see here. Nope. 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 Yep, that's it. All right. Put that over there. And there we have it. So I'm playing Stephen Parker, the host of Dads and Dice. I'm going to see uh, if he wants to be in voice chat. There we go. And he's, he said, yeah. he's asking Bobby to I'm like, yeah, let's do voice. There we go. Hey there. It's Buckethead. Hey, hey Buckethead. <laughs> this is Steven. Um, joined by Lee. He's going to be, he is hosting the room. Um, and it's going to be streaming on our end. Um, Lee, they're going to be streaming on their channel as well. It's uh, Team Met Killers. Okay. I've actually already started. I did my intro, so I'm good. And okay. I and I introduced you guys. Cool. Okay. Cool. I was like, We're just working on the overlay. Are, are, so are we live on your channel? You're live right now. Right now. Okay. Right okay. now. Well, <laughs> hello, uh, community <laughs> of Team Met Killers. So Howdy. I am uh, I'm actually kind of new to this community. Tell us more about yourself. Well, actually, let's but let's do that whenever we stream. Yeah, give me two seconds. I just need to check that my audio is good. Sorry. Oh, we Take your time. Take as long as you want. I had to totally wipe my system. Yeah, I wiped my system here recently, so I, uh, I'm i starting from scratch. Been working on it the last half hour. All right, so we roll dice set. over here. Is that where we roll dice at? Um, I usually roll dice right here, just on the board. Oh, on the board. Okay, okay. Yeah. I was wondering what token site meant. Now I know. Yeah, the token side where the tokens are at. Yep. Yep. Uh, okay, so a big green blob. Well, that didn't work. <laughs> supposed to get the icons so, on the sides. I don't know why the icons aren't rotating. Oh, well. The arc icons? I don't know what I'm saying. I should play yeah. ship. Oh, well. There we go. It's Quantum Storm. It's got lightning bolts on the front. <laughs> <laughs> this ship is so hard to paint so because the whole top is segmented into different parts of the uh, parts of the bitmap, and so you oh, can't really? just draw a straight line across it. Oh, yeah, wow. yeah, it's horrible. <laughs> so, tell me more about the rules of the huge ship. Like, what do I need to know? Um, whatever speed I go, you get crit damage. Um, if I go a zero speed and overlap, you take zero crit damage. If I overlap Wait, a small ship, I have to that, roll a die. SAP, SAP hit me, right? Yeah, if I, if I overlap you. If you overlap me, nothing happens. Okay. Right, so... Well, you move first or last? I move last and shoot first. Although I'm placed on the board, the very first placement of the ships, I get placed first. Okay, and bonus attacks, like, can you take... As much as I have energy for. Works? Yeah. Okay. Out of energy, or from out of bonus, I can only use each header once. So if you look at the okay. uh, point defense battery, it has four headers. 
I mean, I can yeah. only do it four times. And it's rating with the two, yeah. so you just gotta. Your game is to stay far, to stay at range three while shooting me, I guess, right? Yep. Four, well, so what did you say was range two? Uh, so all your weapons are range two. Yeah. Well, it's my primary is one to three. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, here that was it was partly covered. Now you can see it better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So C three PO for rolling defense die. You can spend yeah. your token. You get a lot of number one or higher. So you basically you just say one, and then you can add an evade if you're on evade. Yeah. So at range three, if I'm defending, I get my one evade. <laughs> I'm guaranteed okay. to get it. <laughs> um. Right. So are are you doing the plus twenty five, or you did you change it to a different number? Just twenty five. Okay. I'm just trying to get the uh, default. So I've got my audio. I'm not picking up yours. I'm working on that. Where are your system cards? Do you... uh, I have my minor off the side. I've already picked the one I'm playing. And it's okay. face down for now until we're ready to reveal. So we assign it to a ship? Well, it depends. Some don't get assigned to ships. How do you know? Does it say it? Um, it'll say, you know, choose one ship at this part or whatever. Like if it's a force upgrade, you choose a ship and that ship now has a permanent force upgrade on it. Okay. <clears throat> Yeah, it'll say choose one of your ships. Either, either during like the placement step or for the first activation, somewhere around there. Some abilities are just standing abilities that just hang on for the whole match, you know, stuff like that. Yeah. So like I'll go through some I'm not using right now. Uh, like Hoth is a standing ability. It's Almost not an ability. Why is it not separating? Give me the card. There we go. <laughs> Yank it. <laughs> so this one's you're always rolling two dice when overlapping obstacles. Uh, Jakku is a standing ability after an enemy ship. So this is just for me. You don't get to use this ability here. But that one's for everybody, both friendly and non-friendly. Um, so Jakku is when uh, when after any any ship is destroyed, I might choose a friendly ship at range one of myself. Or at range one of the uh, destroyed ship and then recover a non-recurring shield or charge token uh, home fleet doesn't matter because it's you know the last one you'll probably use monitor jump points all of your ships start in reserve at the start of the planning phase deploy your ships in the starting zone I'm not using that one Whew. so let's see here none of mine actually get assigned which is kind of weird I never got any, oh, any of the assigned ones but Kessel and Ryloth have one charge so I use that once per game so they're not nearly as strong okay. as some of other ones, but yeah. I mean, I've already picked mine. Are you are you sh uh, sure on yours? Uh, yeah. I mean, I we guess. could go over it. Um, it's Mustafar. Yep. It's um, at the start of the engagement phase, you can spend a charge from this card. If you do, your ships may perform attacks even if they're overlapping Yeah, Yeah, so that's not assigned to anybody. So I can just do it. Yeah. Like, so like uh, the last match, the other guy had Oct two, and that one said choose a ship at the at the start of the uh, or after after the place forces step, that ship gains plus one force charge. Oh wow. So he would essentially assign that to a ship. So anything that, that would affect his force charges or whatever would affect that ship. That could be really good. Yeah. <laughs> it was really good until he rolled blanks. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's true. <laughs> and it took four hits on his ETA. <laughs> oh no. Oh wow. Yeah, he blanked out. He's like, "Well, my force don't matter." <laughs> all right, Lee, you ready? Uh, I'm just having a bit of trouble with my audio, but I think I'm just gonna have to put it all through the Relevator channel. Well, you got a team doing yours? You got a couple guys? We try. We try. We got a, another couple guys who help out too. I'm like a solo operation over here. So like, got to team up. So usually I stream from my computer, but since like I'm playing, Lee's hosting, and he had to get some stuff set up. So yeah, uh, since he hasn't, since he doesn't regularly stream from his computer, it takes a few extra minutes for him. No to we had it all set up, and then it totally got wiped. So I got a virus that was wicked bad. Oh no. Yeah, I mean the name being Team Met Killers, you'd think I'd have a team. I'm not there yeah. yet, though. 
All right, so Hosnian Prime has one gas cloud, two debris clouds. So I'll just take those out now. Yeah, Steve and I just can't seem to separate our audio. It's okay. Why don't you just drop down a channel? Well, you could, see, yeah, because it's only it's only going to be you in that chat channel. All right. I want to be able to like. Well, we're going to be able to talk though. Two asteroids, two gas clouds. Well, let's just go live and we'll see what people say. So, so it's, it's not it's only showing like my Oculus headset and my um my uh just go live. All right. Off we go. Hey, Lee, are we live? Yes, we are. Welcome to Dials and Dice. So tonight we have Buckethead, so a Team Mechheads versus Steven Parker of Team Dad. So how are you guys doing tonight? Yeah, I'm doing good. Doing well. Great. Glad to have you. So this is an interesting format we have here. So Steven and um, and I'm so sorry, Buckethead. Do we have a real name or do you use that on stream? I use that on stream. That's fine. So Buckethead, how does this format work? We talked a little bit about last week, Steven. So but maybe you guys can kind of explain what you guys are getting into. So if you think of it like here's the Aturi cluster plus uh, what's that 40k uh, football game? Blood Bowl. Blood Bowl. Blood Bowl. So it's ho it's like here's the Aturi cluster because at the end of every match you earn credits that you would spend on purchasing upgrades for your ships um, or pay for training uh, like you would uh, to in increase your initiative in Hotak, but instead of you know just going up one initiative at a time, you just go to the next, the next card that uh, that, that you know atomic mass has produced. So that way, it's easy to keep track of just the cards itself. You're not fudging hmm. around with numbers. Um, and the the I don't know who who has played Blood Bowl before, but Blood Bowl is very similar in the fact that you have players, and then you earn income at the end of every game, and it's randomized. So hmm. kind of like that. Sounds interesting. And then every every system that there is, every single system card uh, has different obstacles that are included. Um, and because people earn income at different rates because you have to roll for it, uh, let's say you're like uh, Steven over here who's rolled uh, less than most. And so he's his counterplay is to play a system that allows fewer units to be deployed to well, kind of control the size like... of the game. I also spent my points on upgrading my ships instead of adding more ships as well. Yeah. So, like, like I had a buy for the first round and rolled 120 points. Oh, that's I right. I spent points on upgrading from Yoda to Shock T to Obi-Wan. And then right here, I went from um, the Jedi Knight to Lumi to Plo and then buying the upgrades. But So, it takes a lot of points to upgrade your pilots. Yeah. Um, so, that's... That's why I have name pilots versus he's got all generics. You know, all generics. <laughs> Cuz he's got a lot more stuff, but I've got more He's got higher quality stuff. stuff. Yeah. Yeah. I've got the the new shiny. <laughs> nice. Yeah. And then the winner gets to take the other person's system card away. Ooh. And each system brings benefits to the player that brings it. Okay. Yeah. So you want to cool. read your card first uh and so yeah. So my Oops. system card yep. is Mustafar. It's got one charge. It says obstacles, two asteroids, two gas clouds. Your opponent acquires this card if you lose. And the ability is the high ground. At the start of the engagement phase, you may spend a charge from this card. If you do, your ships may perform attacks even if they are overlapping asteroids this round. So hopefully I won't have to use it, but I've got it just in case. Or you so. could like surprise me like... 
I don't think you're going to use it, then you just hop on the asteroid and fire where I can't shoot back. <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure. Fire everything. Uh, mine's a little beefy. It's Hosnian Prime. Uh, obstacles is plus one gas cloud and two debris clouds. Loss, uh, my opponent acquires this card, but we have the Flight Academy on Hosnian Prime. While you defend each friendly ship in the attack arc at range zero to one, of you may suffer one hit or crit to cancel a matching result. So I don't really take away damage. I just spread his damage out. So it's like nice. Biggs. Yeah, Biggs, Biggs Dark Lighter on the board at all times. <laughs> I like it. Cool. Sounds like an interesting format. What uh, Did you come up with it or did someone in your community come uh, up with it? I came up with it in 1.0, but in 1.0 we ha I used the map from Outer uh, from Rebellion. The board game. Oh and yeah. We used the mat and played a league on a map, and each system had their own variants. And I was like, you know, we could, I could port this over to make it more accessible. If you don't have a board, we'll just have, I'll just print out cards. So. Cool. And I like ported it. it to two point yes. Yeah. It's really interesting. I, I really like the aspect of like building your squadron with your points and like, it, it reminds me of like playing Need for Speed. You know, like yeah, upgrade upgrading your car. And tricking it out. and Yeah. Like, yeah. So. And the cool thing about this, too, is that you don't have, I mean, you could easily change it so you earn income quicker, or you could make it so, so your starting on. base is larger or smaller. It sounds, it sounds yeah. like they can't hear us on stream. Uh, like I said, I'm having some trouble. <laughs> can you turn up, like, can you turn up the output on Discord You're, or something, or? You are maxed to the max. What about in Streamlabs? Does it show it? To the max. So we're all running through the same channel. I cannot seem to get it to separate out, so I lose you every time I try. Uh, Sorry, folks. Well, let's just get started then. And, um, well, um, Lee, you can see what you can do about that you know, yep. and try to improve it. I've been listening and working on it, <laughs> so and, I'll keep okay. figuring it out. I don't want to be rude, right, but so... I want to correct uh, him, it, Lee. It was, uh, it's, not it's Team Mech Killers on the. Oh, Twitch. I'm so yeah, sorry. Not Team, team Mech, Mech Killers. <laughs> Although we are Mech Heads, I love BattleTech. Are you kidding? I'm a Mech Head cool. all the way. <laughs> gotcha. I do apologize. So okay. Team Mech Heads, right, check so them out. I guess I place first obstacle. Uh, well, you did bring lower points, so you have the initiative token. Unless you want to pass it to me. So I have initiative though on everything. Yeah. So uh, right now you're I'll, player one, unless I'll, you want to give it up. I will take it. Okay. Move these away a little bit. All right. All right. You're not going to use that asteroid you're putting on my side? <laughs> Maybe you'll end up over here. Yep. So with the epic ship, if I overlap an asteroid or debris cloud, I have to suffer a crit. Yeah. Um, and I lose one energy, or I can stress on both of those. If I go over a glass, a gas cloud, I just, uh, I just, I think I just take a jam. Yeah, I take a jam. But the obstacle oh. gets either way. The obstacles get removed from the table. So. Okay. It's like a, it's like an oh, icebreaker, right? right over. You just run them over and. Take them out. There we go. All right. I'm going to go ahead and place my big ship first. Let's just get rid of these, these markers here. Unlock them all. Do you have the turret uh, indicators that show the white lines on the outside of the ship? Yeah. Where are those? Right here. Why isn't it working? Hang, Hang on a second. I gotta fix it. Ah. Oh, how'd you do that? You right click on it, state. What? Oh, man, that's so cool. Okay. <laughs> there you go. Learn something new every day. I only have one, so I'll just put the one. Okay. There we go. Okay. 
Well, I saw one on the back. I didn't know if that meant anything. Nah, so. that was an accident because I was trying to put that marker on there. <laughs> so, it's, so it's range two from this, from this. From no, from its whole base. Oh, okay. So the the epic ship has four arcs, just like your ships. Front has flanks and a rear arc. Yeah. So if I rotate it to the, it's a like rotate defense points. There we go. Now it's on the left and right, but those big triangles right there. Okay. And can I see the dial somehow? Let me see. Um, I might be able to use the dial thing. Where's the dial card? Yep. There we go. But it moves. That doesn't use these templates to move, so it moves really different. Yeah, it, it uses the the side lock templates. Yeah. All right, so what's your initiatives here? A five, five and a five. Oh, gosh. You get to see my whole formation first. All right. Well, let's put up the range one. Yeah. You literally? You know what? I am st just working on this. <laughs> He's working hard in the background. Trying. Yeah, that looks good. Whoops. Align and place all those ships. Oh, I got to rename these guys. I got, I made special nicknames for all my guys. So if you hit your own huge ship, what happens? Same thing. You take a crit? I take a crit, yeah. Well, actually, the ship gets picked up and moved after, so after the huge ship overlaps it. So the huge ship overlaps yeah. the ship. Then you have to use the full rear arc. And then you place, if I run over your ship, you place your ship in the whole back arc. And then I choose to rotate it 90 degrees if I want to. Or if I run over my ship, I place it somewhere in the whole back arc. And then, and then you rotate it 90 degrees. Although there's a trick. If you place it so your side of your base is completely flush, then your opponent can't rotate it. It's a little gimmicky, but you know you can't rotate it if it's completely flush, because the nubs get in the way. Huh. Yeah. So if you want to be, you know, next to my ship, or so you don't get shot, and so I don't rotate you away, put your flat side of your ship up against my. If you put the nub side against it, right, like this, then I can yeah. rotate it, and you'll be just off of me where I can shoot you. <clears throat> okay. So. Or if I accidentally overlap mine, I'm going to place it in such a way where you can't spin me because I want to shoot you. <laughs> uh -huh. Let's see here. So I can turn the huge ship? No, you turn the small ship 90 degrees if it's my small ship. If it's yours, I'll turn yours, but you get to place it somewhere. Oh. Yeah. Nervous about this game. I spelled, yeah. A big thing over there. Well, um, you know how you have to roll if you die? You are always yeah. allowed to flee off of your edge of the board and not have to roll eject. You're safe. Okay. So if you get my B Wing down to like one hall, I will plead with you. Please let him leave the board. <laughs> Uh, I don't want to no, roll. Never. I don't want to roll crit blank and permanently permanently lose my B wing. <laughs> uh, and, and good news, it's round robin, so you'll never face me again. You're only hurting the next guy. <laughs> yeah. And vice versa. If you want to, if you want to take a guy at the board to save your eject roll, I'll, I'll totally let you. I'm, I'm nice like that. <laughs> Okay. Uh, I don't know if you watched the last game uh, that I streamed, but uh, there was a, a Yoda with one health left, and then the guy just dealt, like, you know, max damage, like four hits to him. <laughs> he's like, yeah, I'm not late. And he was so close to his edge of the board, he could have escaped, but he's like, boom. 
just brutalized them. I'm like, no. Oh well, so that's what happened. Do we need the range rulers anymore? I don't think so. Okay. How do you queue so, up the full like back before, arc? Let me see here. Before, uh, before I had realized that you had to start with Yoda, I had upgraded from the I-4 to I-5. Yeah. And I had the points to add in um, a um, Gold Squadron Trooper with Proton Rockets. What? So I could throw the I could throw the focus with pro with a Plo Koon. Nice. And target lock, but didn't have the points because I did it well, wrong. Well, you got fourteen <laughs> points still. You know, I don't know if you want to use yeah. that real quick. I, well, I don't have them to spin. Yeah. Well, I mean, um, I adjusted your points because when you buy items that are variable cost, you pay the lowest cost when you buy it from the market. Are you adjusting my points? I did. You overpaid for your uh, stealth device. Oops. It's okay. Hang on a second. Let me look. But when you equip it, it's still for eight points. It's just when you buy it, you buy it for the lowest cost. Yeah. Makes losing it less, no, not as harsh. So where's my tracking sheet? loading there's yours yeah so about the big green blob i mean they're all green with red dots whole squadron matches they have 14 points yeah that's what i said what the heck hang on a second then he's a noob whatever so i adjusted right, this so square right here Does sense have a variable cost, or is that single cost for sense? Um, it says five. I think it's a single cost. Okay. Um. Got it. All right. Adding Got extreme it. maneuvers to Obi. Got it. I hear Got somebody. Is that my? What is that? I heard something. Yeah, should be should be me. I heard something in the background. All right. Was... Um, I'm gonna update the TTT thing. Oh, that's right. Let's see here. Let's see here. Yeah, since it's just a single cost. Okay. What are you adding over there? What? Uh, extreme maneuvers on Obi. You want to so copy do... copy paste that uh, your XWS for me in the in the Discord? Yeah. Same. Something doesn't sound right. Yeah, we can barely hear you, Lee. It's like cutting in and out. This is what I call a TMK broadcast. Because it's not a TMK yeah. broadcast unless something goes wrong. Fine. <laughs> You're like cutting in and out really bad. I don't know what's going on. Comment. Comment. I heard him say comment. It says we can hear you. Um, Lee's coming loud and clear. Uh, what about us? Can they hear us? Yeah, they're saying that we're too quiet for them to hear on the stream, but it's it's fine. Lee can fill them in. Apparently, but I have. Why don't you? Uh... All right, I'm ready to start. All right. I'll start the timer for the overlay. Um, my dials aren't set yet. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, my yeah. Uh, let's see here. All right, guys. So I'm gonna have an.
terrible. Apologize. No. Covering. Great. We thought we had everything working. Sound. So. Do apologize. But again, so even playing Buckethead of Met Killer podcast, they're actually. Here, let's do this. There I we go. That night, I. What's let's on? um. So they're setting up. I dropped this to another chat channel so that. There you go. That works. Yeah, because it's cutting in and out really bad. All right, All right my I'm dolls set. are set. We're good. All right. If you want to start the timer on the table. All right. One, two, three, go. And then I go. All right. And then we'll take a focus here. Oops, that's the wrong guy. Uh... There we go. Play three bank boost. Um, well, I'll just do that as an action. All right. Um, uh, OB two straight. Um, actually, cancel. Extreme maneuvers. Dude, where's that card at? Did you put the card? Oh, I, yeah, I, I'm gonna need to reload this actually. Um, hang on. Does it allow him to do like a one tight? Yeah. So then, what do you want? Turn right one, or turn one. Hang or, on. Yeah. I fix it. It's like you can just type it in. Okay, you got it. Yeah, TR1 for turn right one, or uh, TL2, or TL1 for turn left one. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and go with my Echo Base. Oh, I didn't assign it. That's really weird. I got, like, lost somehow. What? Oh, that's because I renamed it, maybe. Why isn't my dial set anymore? Oh, there it goes. Okay. He'll do a one straight. Then he will do reinforce link to a calculate. And a focus token. Why not? There you go. It's still not giving me the option. Well, you just got to type it in. Yeah. Under the description. If you want, I can help too. Just tell me you want to turn, you know, boost tight turn left or something. Yeah. 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 All right. Which way do I want to go? I don't know yet. All right, I'm set. All right. All right, system phase. Yeah, it's been a force to barrel roll. Why are you ducking out on me? Because <laughs> I'm a data. <laughs> All right, you're up. Okay. Uh, let's see here. He'll focus. He'll focus, and he'll focus. There you go. Uh, 
how it goes. You set? Yep. All right. Two straight. Yeah, that'll do me. All right. Uh, reinforce link to double calculate from C3PO and focus. All the tokens. I don't think we have range yet, do we? I don't think so. All right. Maybe this, maybe, I think I'm good. Oh, no, I'm not good. I'm not good. I could do better. Let's do this. All right. Uh, hang on. Okay, I'm set. All right. Uh, um, sister phase. Yeah. I got a barrel roll. All right. Two bank blue. Um. We'll we'll take a focus. Here we go. He's going to take a stress and potentially a crit. Of course. Of course. Target, I wow. tell you, man, you're getting that one. Losing the shield. All right. He's fine. He'll, he's fine. We're all fine here. Uh, we're not going to roll. We're going to do a, a focus. Okay. Yeah. Obi Wan, two bank. Um. You evade. Okay. So one bank. Uh, spin up force. Barrel roll and take a focus. Cool. All right, echo base evacuees. Oh, look at that! I thread the gap with a huge ship. Didn't even oh, highlight. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> look at that! Wow. Yeah. I'm gonna attempt a white coordinate, so that's gonna be our range two on this guy. Bimi's going to go for a target lock. I don't know who I got, but I'm going to try. Oh, oh, ho, 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 ho. Who, who do I want to shoot? Uh, I may have more shots at uh, Obi-Wan, so I'm going to target lock Obi-Wan. Okay. All right. Then for his second action, he'll reinforce and link that to a calculate. And I'll reinforce the front. There we go. I guess start All of right, combat. Calculate. Okay, start of combat. Yeah. C-3PO? What about C-3PO? C-3PO, he gave me the second oh. calculate. And C-3PO's okay. when I defend. Yeah. All right. All right, Obi-Wan first, eh? Splatter. Oh, no. <laughs> Three dice for BME plus one for obstructed. Is that right? Let me see here. Uh, yep. 
All right. Uh, for two. All right. I got it. Got three. Um. Let's see, what does it say? Bucket. Is it range three and bullseye? All right. Let's do that. Going into the bucket. To add. Add a focus. Focus. And I will spend the focus. All right. Hosnian nice. Prime will, because uh, the Quantum Storm, let's see if it's at range one or not. Nope, I can't Quantum, but I'll take it on uh, on yellow. Boop. So what are you doing? I am using the quant uh, Hosnian Prime's ability to cancel a hit and then suffer a hit on yellow. Oh, nice. So, he's down a shield. Uh, okay. <laughs> All right, you're up. All right, I gotta mark off. Yellow and red are down shields. Boop, boop, there we go. All right, Buckethead is probably gonna miss this shot, but we're gonna try it anyways. Primary weapon into Obi-Wan. I get three, plus range three. Plus obstructed. Plus device. Was oh, yeah. Good. All of that. Yeah. All of that. All of that. And if I manage to get one through, it's a miracle. <laughs> yep. Here we go. Force of aid. I'm going to fire control the blank. And I'm missed. Because if you turn a blank or an evade, you're out. You're out. So, extra oh, out. I got four evades. All right. We'll do splatter. Same dice. One, uh, same target? Yeah. So that's three. Hey, I got a hit crit. Plus delta device. You get six again, yeah. All the dice. So it's kind of a Hail Mary. All right. Um, Very, good. Of Very good. Very <laughs> good. Unobstructed range three. So same shot, but one less die for you. Uh, One hit. Uh, you're probably you got the guaranteed evade token. Oh, you got it. Just barely. Yeah. All right. I have Plo Koon at range three. So I will fire primary, which is a two die attack. Two. Uh oh. Taking shield. One, oh, one got through? <laughs> Dang. I've been shooting the wrong guy. <laughs> yeah. Green tokens go away. Pew. I don't know. I just had more focus fire in Obi-Wan, so maybe a zigging like one will get through and break that stealth. That gas cloud was definitely working to your advantage. Yeah, it was. Yeah. Splatter. What to do with splatter? This is the hard one. I guess that's what I'm doing. All right, I am set. Me too. Okay, system phase. System phase. I'm going to barrel roll. That way? Okay. And I think I just messed myself up. Okay. Alright. I'm going to go ahead All and right. go then. 
Yep. Okay. We'll do this guy first. He's going to go ahead and clear his stress. He'll take a focus. This guy, he's going to roll to see if he uh, gets a strain or not and loses his action. That's a strain. These gas clouds. The bucket is going to go there. And he'll take a target lock action. Yeah. That's the wrong guy. I apologize. It's both the red dials. There we go. Oh, what am I doing? I, I'm in range. We know I'll be okay. I don't play this game like much. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> the way I handle my dials, though, I tell you. <clears throat> okay, so there we go. We'll get rid of the old target lock. All right. There we are. Baby. Oh. 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 You don't get a strain? Did I miss something? Oh, okay. And yeah, I just you... use my ability. I use my ability to get a focus. Oh, let's see. After finish, after finish, after finish. Ah, I'm pretty cool. sure you range one of me. Yeah, yeah. That's cool. You don't lose your action, but you turtle up a little bit. Yep. Uh, oh, he bumps. Straight. Okay. <clears throat> Echo base and... evacuees. Oh, yes, unless yep. you get action still, right? Or no? Uh, no. Okay. Two straight. Um... Well, with that said, I think, uh, well, I'll reinforce the front first because I got Obi-Wan shooting at me. I'll link that to a calculate, and then I'll take a focus. There we right. go. So, so Obi-Wan's first, right? Yep. Ra oh, I got a die. I get a die. Okay. I'm starting in range three. Oh, I get two dice. You get two. This is yeah. incredible. I never felt more agile in a big ship before. <laughs> One. All right. <clears throat> Let's just see if I get this on its own. No C-3PO's. All right. Got it. All right. Um, goes to bucket. No shots because we're bumping. Z 95s both no shots. So the Quantum Storm will do the front arc. Ooh, is what is Obi Wan obstructed? Um, no. Ooh, is this? You know what? I'm gonna go after Plo Koon. He's got less force, right? How much force does he have? Uh, he has one. Force. One force. Okay. We're gonna do primary gun first. Just three dice. Not four. There we go. And I'll spin the focus for three. I'll spin off force. Take one. All right. And then I'll spend one energy to do my first round of or first point defense battery. So I'll do three dice again. Okay. I will spin oh, the calculate. God. I got lucky on that one. Yeah, he's dead. Hit crit crit. Uh, you got an evade, so it's just two crits. Uh, crit. Direct. Oh, that's a dead one. Or another direct. Wow. Then I'll do just one more attack into Obi-Wan Kenobi. And okay. I'll do... It's only two dice this time. So I get... Um, You're normal, because there's no, no obstruction. So I get three. Plus stealth device, because you strain. haven't taken damage yet. I'm strained. Oh, you, okay. Okay. 
And I'll spend the calculate for two. Oh no! Spin the focus. Take a damage. I'm gonna stop shooting this round. Okay. All right. <coughs> General Kenobi. <laughs> yeah. All right. Is he going to stay and fight, or does he want to go off his edge of the board, not roll? Um, I don't know. Okay. Got to figure that out. Well, I will. we can negotiate a ceasefire unless you want to break it. <laughs> All right, I'm set. Okay. System phase? <clears throat> nope. Okay. Uh, he's going to keep his strain and do that. Okay. okay. One hard. Um... Spend a force for my ability. Arrow roll. Alright. Uh, gain one energy at the end of the round. Did a white maneuver, gain a second energy back. I'm going to spend an action to rotate my point defense gun. Um, and then I will... You are squarely in the back half. Reinforce the rear and link it for a calculate. All right. All right. Do you choose violence? Auto blasters range one. He chooses. You choose violence. Okay, here we go. <laughs> All right, so marksmanship. Um. Then a force, um, and then R seven A seven. That's a charge, yeah. All right, so two of them are uncancelable, but I do get to cancel the one because of reinforce. Yeah. So I take two shields. Wait, do you get them back? I get one back a turn. Gosh, it's gonna take forever. Yeah, All right, and now I get up. four attacks, potentially. All right, fire arc front from this guy. He's range three obstructed. Uh, we'll do... Let's see, my jamming beam is probably range two, isn't it? Of course it is. All right, primary weapon fire. Hit crit. Dodge, dodge. Two aids. Very good. Nothing there, and for sure nothing here. All right. That's the wrong arc. Fire arc point defense. Yes. Okay. You are range one, no obstruction. Wow. All right. So I have to spend the energy for the point defense gun, so... This is the first attack. Uh, I'm going to miss it. I'll let it ride. So next attack. And we'll spend the calculate. Uh, you still have self device, yes? No. 
Oh, it broke. Take a damage. That's right. Okay. Panic pilot. No more barrel rolling near a phase, which means I gotta run over a debris cloud. <laughs> oh no! It's the worst thing for it, Etta. Uh, do you do you want me to continue firing, or you want to not roll the roll the uh, dice for the explosion? Um, I, I would like to not roll the dice. Okay. Well, we'll you, uh, you're on the comps. We're, we're waving the white flag, I assume. Then I'll let you fly off your edge. Am I gonna? What, so I'm gonna fly off my board edge. You gotta fly off your board edge. These are all still on there. Can you make it? What? What do you say? How do you say? Um, just like uh, concede. Yeah, that's what you do. Is you fly off your board edge. I won't shoot you if you don't shoot me. I'll let you decide. <laughs> all right, I'm not gonna shoot. I'm just gonna go off my board edge. All right. I will, uh, let's see here, see if I can clear a path for you. You're doing the wrong maneuver. I get a roll for, um... Yeah, you have to roll for Plo Koon. So I have to roll what? To see if I do what now? Uh, you roll two dice to see if he blows up. So the pilot just would die? He could die. So I have to just buy a new one to start with? Uh, well, if he, he may not die, though. That's, uh, that's the hope, right? Yeah, I know, but if he does, like... Yeah, that... you gotta start over again with that ship. Or buy a All different right. ship. I can't turn the page. It's not letting me. Can you operate the page of the PDF? It's not loaded in properly. Oh, there you go. One more page. There's your escape rolls. Okay. Hope that was bad. Okay. Uh -huh. And he'll just take a focus. Oh, you flew right past him. That's good. No crit. All right. Look. Oh, I don't hit my guy. Woof, that's close. Here, I'll target lock you just in case you decide to change your mind. There you go. Okay. <clears throat> All right. I got so many to set. Oh, that's not good. Here we go. All right, I'm ready. All right. System phase doing anything? Boosting or something? I oh, know you're stressed. Never I mind. can't. Yeah. All right. Oh, no. That was dumb. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. <laughs> All right. Your move. Okay. Does a five straight take you off? 
Oh, yeah. All right. Let's go ahead and roll for Plo Koon. Let's see what happens to him. All right. So you two pretty dice. much have a 1 in 20 chance of dying, so it's pretty low. All right. All right. Hit. You lose your most expensive upgrade. No refunds on Plo Koon. So where does it say that in the rule book so we can show this dream? Right there. Whoop. I'm trying to follow. Here we go. All right. At least one hit. Choose an upgrade card assigned to the ship at random. That upgrade is lost. Oh, it's, it's at least one hit. Never mind. It's not the most expensive. It's just one. Choose one up random. Lost. No refund. There you go. All right. So you got to shuffle these together, right? Yep. There you go. Not too bad. Try putting him face down. Oh, there you go. You got it. You want to put him in a bag? All right. Oh, there I can go. just shuffle and then like three, two, two one. Oh, stop. <laughs> I one. Stop. All right. Your configuration. How many points does that cost you? It's like five points or something. No, like that's that. not bad. Blue Coon's not recovered, bad. but his configuration's broken. Needs to be replaced. It's four points. There you go. Not bad. I'll take this. The Moose Device System is mine. So now right. what? That's it. For points? Yeah. You have you have a uh, hyperspace lane, yeah. Um, you, you throw, the, yeah, you do. I want the chevrons? Aurelian trade spine. Yeah. Um, uh, I'm gonna keep my roll. That's good. That is really good. All right, that's the right. The next page is right. There you go. There. Sixty, forty, and twenty. So that's one hundred twenty. So how do you reroll? Uh, if you win. Oh, okay. But I'm not. I'm not using my reroll. Oh dear. Okay. Forty points. Dang. Yeah. All right. I gotta add a, a ship. I can. I can get a gold squad trooper with proton rockets. Do it. And get my CLT back. Do it. I have, uh, uh, looks like, I think I have a Jawa in my office right now. What is this? Come over here, Jawa. What are you doing in here? Come over here. Get over here right now. Come here. Come say hi. Oh, he's stealing stuff off my desk. Come here, you. Come here, Ben. Come here. Oh, he's running the way. He took a Lego off my dad tire. He's a Jawa, I swear. <laughs> <laughs> As a little four-year-old. <laughs> Just took something off my desk and ran away. He's supposed to be in bed. If mom catches him, it's he's going to be in trouble. If you're going to come in here taking my stuff, you got to come and say hi to daddy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> come say hi. People are interested in the Hi, everybody. Say hello. There you go. <laughs> All right, I'll get in bed before you get in trouble, okay? Okay, I don't know what he said, but he has to do something. <clears throat> All right, well, thanks for hosting me, and thanks for, uh, you know, showing your, your crew, your, your fans, the uh, exhibition uh, match. He didn't hear yeah. no bell. <laughs> Who's Ben in chat? Ben. <laughs> The bell didn't ring. Game's not over. Yeah, the bell's over. The, game, the, bell's, the game's over. Bell rang. All right. Uh, was there any announcements you wanted to make uh, for your for your community? Uh, yeah, go follow Dials and Dice um, on Twitch and YouTube. Uh, we post our content on YouTube as well. Um, Is that all one uh, word, Dials and Dice, or you guys use the ampersand? Uh, and. It's the, the word and. Okay. 
Yeah, I put it yeah. in my chat. Thousand dice. I'm gonna follow you right now and rewatch this from from your perspective. <laughs> yeah, it, it's probably a little rough because of uh, Lee was streaming it, but normally when I'm streaming, I um, I have I'm the normal streamer, so my my setup's pretty, you know, you know, load it and go kind of thing. Yeah, yeah, I totally get that. His, from... com his computer, he had to wipe his computer, so um, yeah, he had to start over. So it gives you more of a candid experience. <laughs> Of what it's like behind yeah. the behind the camera, right? <laughs> right. Yeah. That's cool. All right, man. Well, I will catch you later. Uh, if you guys are watching right. the TMK broadcast, Team Mech Killers, I hope you guys have a great night and an even better tomorrow. Bye, guys.